Hey everybody, want to wheeze them back for part 27 of our Skylander Spirals adventure playthrough. Uh, we just left the elemental gate from the earth element, brought Dino Ring into the game. Uh, I'm actually going to come back out now. We will switch from Dino Ring to Stealth Elf. Uh, life element Skylanders are stronger in this zone. So we'll pull Dino Ring, uh, go back to Stealth Elf. Not now, too late. Alright, so it's amazing how fast Stealth Elf, you know she's a level 4 already, I literally, I think, just used her for the first time in Chapter 9, so. Alright, so this is basically, you know, right where we left off. Uh, she does kind of need that, I'll go ahead and grab it. Okay, so the trick here, of course, is going to be time your jumps. Oh crud. And so now we're to the point where the enemies are not one dimensional. They can kind of, you know, run and jump and, you know, just like we saw the trolls in the uh, elemental gate, you know, they were able to, you know, take the bounce pad. Uh, we see them now, they're not like running down the hill, they're actually just like jumping off. So, uh, things are getting a little tougher on that end. But Got our oh, this is the third treasure chest actually, so that's cool. We still need the legendary treasure. Uh, got Stealth Elf Soul Gem here, of course. So now we've got to get back down here, time that. You must find rockets to destroy the big chainsaws, Portal Master. Okay, yeah, so the rockets are up there, obviously. <laughs> um, I don't know if we're below that or not. So I guess that's an owl, too. Kind of cool. Uh, got a good look at it that last time. So the rockets should be right up here. Along with a stash of treasure. I think we can shoot it from here. Yeah. I think it takes five rockets to get it. The problem is we can't ever really keep them. Yeah. So we've got two left. Uh, now we're actually gonna... Oh, I guess it won't let me drop down there, so... I'll have to go about it this way. Not too big of an inconvenience. Gotta say, I mean, this game is a lot of fun. Uh, I'm not sure what those are. <laughs> okay, I I didn't know if they like explode or what. I hope the legendary treasure is something we can find. You know, uh, I guess I'll kind of explore if it'll let me drop off, which it's not. Uh, that sucks. Okay, so there's like that whole area and I don't get to explore it. It's kind of the game's glitching out. <laughs> Great. Okay. Glad I started a new video. You again. Foolish portal master imposter. Wait. Portal Foster. <laughs> yes, I, I like the sound of that. But you are still doomed! Doomed, I tell you! You will never possess the eternal life source! Never! You face my powerful evil life minion! Now I will laugh while it both powerfully and evilly ends yours! <laughs> okay. So we've got a, uh, another battle here. Go on! Get on with it! Hence why we're, you know, with... Alright, so that's... I guess Zook, I think? Or Camo? Oh, crud. Uh, Stealth Elf does not have good defense, as mentioned. And 
luckily the watermelon came, you know. Okay, forget the light minion. You won't beat this, because I, Lord, summon my unbeatable deadly life spell of death. Yeah, so hopefully this one isn't as cheesy as the Doom Sharks, but I have a feeling it will be. Attack the red snails. Uh, luckily we are Stealth Elf here. She's very quick. I could see this with Stump Smash maybe being an issue. At least unupgraded, you know. So it's kind of a, uh, you know, pattern puzzle type thing, if you will. Stop. You can dodge a few things you can see. Big deal. What about things you can't? Yeah, this one could be... Ah. Stealth Elf. Okay, so she's doing her attack. So you can kind of see she's attacking me when I do the decoy. Uh, which we're kind of beating chaos at his own game when we do that. All right. Awesome, we got the watermelon tea. Yeah, that's all right. I have something even more evil in mind. More evil and unbeatable than ever before. I summon a evil, deadly evil life spell of ultimate death. <laughs> yeah. Right. Uh. Probably the same thing, just sped up, you know. Oh, uh, yes, it is sped up a bit. Uh, conveniently, the way that's set up, it wasn't too bad that time. Uh, okay, I'm worried about this because I don't see anything to hit. I guess I botched that one thinking there'd be snails with it or something. Okay, yeah, so this is basically a maze. Again, I don't think I touched that, but whatever. That first time, I it was my fault. I kind of assumed it would have snails with it, and it did not. Now it's kind of going to do like a cinnamon roll deal for us, I guess. And there's the snail. If I can get to it, I don't know that I will. Okay, so we barely made that. So this should be Stump Smash or Camo, I believe. Okay, so s drop the hammer, we've got s basically the evil Stump Smash here. Spits something significantly different than we did. I don't know why that was telling me to shake. Oh. That really didn't make much sense. I don't know if I'm supposed to hit those when they kind of like dwindle down or what. We don't have a lot of health left. I hate them. I hate them. Even the evil ones. <laughs> Obviously, I have slightly underestimated you. It won't happen again. I call upon my most powerful and evil life spell of all. So powerful, I dare not speak its name. I summon. Here he is, thank Too bad. Behold! Okay, this one, uh, that last one was fairly tough to dodge. Okay, luckily I realized this was a puzzle before I, you know, crap. 
I really want that pizza. I guess this one you just kind of freehand it, you know? Oh, uh, crap. I'm wanting to get over here. Uh, I didn't think I'd touch that. But since we got those, I think I'll be okay. Crap. Well, it didn't go great, but... Okay, this one could be tough, and I don't have full health. So we've got Stump Smash, Zook, and Stealth Elf here. Um, I don't know what that was really. What, Zook is the only one left? Guess we took care of him? Okay, so sad news is we, I guess, missed the legendary treasure, but uh, good news is we defeated the uh, life minion stealth elves here kind of in a funky plant form. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can get rid of that crud. I guess you can't. But anyway, I'll go ahead and take this. Probably trigger a cutscene. I don't know what I'm doing to miss legendary treasure every time, but uh, basically we did everything but that, and of course the time goal, which you know I'm not going to do any on this first time through. Uh, find the life source, which was the acorn, we got the enemy goal, didn't lose a life, found all the areas, got the story scrolls, treasure chest, hats, and the soul gem, which was of course stealth elf. Ironically, uh, she's battled two of the three bosses here, you know, we had Gilgrunt the first time around, but... Uh, Anyway, she's leveled up quite a bit, so uh, we'll continue. Probably have a cutscene here, which hopefully I can fit it in. We've about at 13 minutes now. I fear the darkness is growing and the core of light is not yet complete. But now you bring the eternal life source, whose true power lies within. What a remarkable creation. We are all remarkable creations. Some more remarkable than others. Like me. Boom! Four down, four to go. We must find the remaining eternal sources before they fall into Chaos's hands. Okay. Situation report. Who's in charge here? In charge? Why, I'm in charge. Of the ladies, that is. Believe it. Stow with a flabberjabber, son. I'm looking for a Skylander. Ah, excellent. I am General Robot, and we've got a fluster cup of a situation. It seems the trolls are keeping something unknown in a heavily guarded warehouse. 
Skylands Intel believes that it's some sort of gear that may have originated from this year location. That's not just any gear. It's a golden gear. The golden gear. We need it to rebuild the core of light. Hmm. This is even more serious than I expected. You see, the enemy is crafty and has the advantage. Uh, temporarily, of course. And we do not at this time have the firepower to evac said gear to a safe location behind our lines to reconnoiter. We need your help, soldier. Can I count on you? Um, right now I'm not gonna do that. I'm actually probably gonna do Dino Rings Roar yes. Challenge. Yes, perhaps you're right. Meet me back here after you resupply. Yeah, that's actually what I kind of plan to do, so. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, obviously we're gonna hear them tell us to talk to General, yeah, like I said, or was trying to say. Uh, let me kinda stroll around, we've got a lot of money here with Stealth Elf. I'll go ahead, uh, I don't think Dino Ring collected quite enough. Uh, you can kinda see Skylands is like, in full bloom right now. <laughs> But, uh, we'll see if we can buy anything with, uh, Stealth Elf, and then I'll come back in, and, uh, we will likely do Dino Ring's Heroic Challenge. There's Persephone, we'll talk to her, let's see what he's, provide, but check back uh, later. he's like an orc, he really sucks. <laughs> okay, uh... I know I could get her some stuff down there, but since we're here, I'll just talk to Persephone and see what we can do. Alright, so, uh... Arbored Acrobatics. Presses E to perform a quick acrobatic move. Okay, and then... That's gonna cost quite a bit more. Uh... Let's just go ahead and do this on the Arbored Acrobatics and check it out. Okay, so before I demo that, uh, let's see what came in its place. Oh, nothing. So, I guess you have to have the money uh, to showcase kind of what it is aside from the soul gem. So, we'll back out and uh, we'll kind of preview this. So that'll, you know, no doubt it'll help us escape a little quicker from some situation, so uh, what I'm going to do now is pause this. Uh, we basically wrapped up, uh, what was it, chapter 11, The Falling Forest, I think? But uh, I think it was 11. Anyway, it's where we battled uh, Chaos and the Life Minions. We collected the Life Source, the Acorn, brought it back, and uh, now we're faced with, uh, looks like we're heading to a what warehouse or factory to battle trolls. Uh, anyway, we're going to talk to General Robot when we come back, but uh, I think, like I said, I'll go ahead and do Dino Rings, Heroic Challenge, then we'll talk to uh, General Robot. But Questions, comments, feel free to ask here on YouTube or the blog, oneofwisdom.blogspot.com. You can follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, whichever you prefer. And as always, thanks for watching.